Hi, this is Cameron with an unboxing for the Camp Solutions Lightweight Self-Inflating Air Sleeping Pad. I've got a camping trip coming up, so pick this up. Um, I've got the box right here. Camp Solutions. Not very exciting, but what's inside could be pretty good. So, I got it in green. Um, let's open it up right here. Wrapped in plastic. Looks like it has a carrying pouch with it. So, comes out just like that with a pouch and a little tie. We'll take it out of the carrying case. Very compact. I don't know if I'll get it this compact when I'm done with it. It's got a strap around here. Just free flows. And there it is. So I've never used this before. I've never used a self-inflating pad before. But this is what it looks like. You probably know how big it is. There's so there's a pillow here at the top that's attached, and I, what I read online is that you, you blow it up manually, but the rest of it is self-inflating. Um, without any air on it, not very padded, but obviously. So I'm gonna just, I'm on the spot here, I'm gonna open this valve up. As soon as I open the valve up, I can feel it wanting to suck air in it. So what are you supposed to do with a self-inflating? I hear it breathing in air. Now I think I saw a video of one of these types of things one time where somebody like... No, maybe not. I think maybe you just let it sit here. I can, I can hear the valve sucking air in, so... It's got um, snaps right here. Looks like when I'm done. When I'm done, I'll snap it in half. This is the way the, the snaps go. Snap it in half like that to roll it up, maybe? Anyway, um, I don't really hear it anymore. All right, you know what? I'm going to look at some instructions. I'm going to look at some instructions. I'm going to figure this out. I'm going to go camping. And then I'm going to come back with the video review where I will also have instructions on how to get it inflated, about how long it takes, whether the pillow is any good, all those good things. And uh, yeah, hope this has been helpful. Maybe not too helpful, but some idea. Um, again, my name is Cameron, and uh, see you next time. Hi, this is Cameron, and I'm out here with my Camp Solutions self-inflating pad uh, on a camping trip. I thought I would give a quick demonstration of how this works and how effective it is. So, take a look at the pad here. It's a little windstorm going on, but here is my pad. You can see the pillow up here at the top, and it is... I'll show you how inflated it is. So, you can get an idea. It's maybe an inch thick. Um, I did sleep on it last night. A um, couple of impressions. Pillow sucks. Pillow is uh, no substitute for an actual pillow. Um, it was much better than being on the ground. It was very easy to inflate. I basically opened up the valve. I let it sit there. don't know how long that took because I just let it sit there for hours. And then it wasn't quite as firm as I wanted, so I blew into it maybe two puffs um, to fill it the rest of the way up. And that gave me a pretty good night's sleep. I wish I would have had a pillow. I recommend bringing your own pillow. Otherwise, um, it should uh, it should do fine if you're not super picky. And I even slept on my side. So, all right, I'll be back with a final review soon. Hi, this is Cameron with a quick video review for the Camp Solutions lightweight uh, sleeping pad. I had a ch hopefully you watched the unboxing and my kind of live demonstration. Had a chance to spend a couple of nights on the sleeping pad. Um, so it, uh, it, it did inflate on its own. I overinflated it with my mouth. I think that was a mistake. 
uh, while I was sleeping, I noticed that the pad was too firm, and I think that was because I overinflated it. Word to the wise, let it inflate itself, let it do its thing. Maybe it seems like it's too cushy, but that's actually probably a good thing if you're on hard ground. Um, also, the pillow, bring your own pillow. The pillow is terrible. I mean, it's a bonus, it's an add-on. So, don't, I, don't, I don't really think it detracts from the product. You might as well have a pillow there. If you forget your pillow, it's better than nothing. It's almost better than nothing. It's debatable whether it's better than nothing. It's not functional as a pillow. So bring your own pillow. Um, still, the self-inflating feature is really cool. I'm a short guy, so the size didn't bother me. But if you're tall, you're gonna want something uh, a little longer. I'm 5'7". With the pillow um, taken into account, I was able to get all the way down to my feet at the end of the at the end of the uh, the, the pad. But without the pillow, I would have I would have been dangling my my ankles over the side. So um, yeah, uh, if you don't overinflate it, it's comfortable, really easy to put away, really easy to inflate. Just open up the valve; it inflates on its own. Give it some time. I don't have any idea how long it takes. I just let it go. I'll leave it for like an hour, whatever. Maybe it only takes 10 minutes. Maybe it only takes five minutes. I don't really know. But you're probably not in a huge time crunch to get to the campsite. Open up the valve, stick it in your tent. Forget about it. Um, and if you really wanted to go faster, you could probably do a little <laughs> inflate it yourself a little bit. So overall, my experience, given how convenient it is, uh, which it is extremely convenient, given that it's comfortable if you don't overinflate it. Given that it's not a bad price, it's very compact. Uh, roll it up in a couple minutes, you just roll the air right out of it while you're rolling it up. It gets a nice little carrying case. Um, but taking into account the size, uh, I am gonna give this a four out of five. And I'm gonna say that for the price and the size, it's pretty good. I would like it to be a little longer. Again, without the pillow, you're going to be into a situation, an issue. If you're 5'7 like me, a lot of people are taller. So, um, oh yeah, and they have snaps on it, which I believe is so that you could attach it and make it a queen uh, instead of a, a twin, which my wife would never sleep on something like this. So, uh, if, if you're, in it, maybe your wife is more rugged outdoorsy, and would be willing to entertain the idea of uh, a one inch pad. My wife needs a, one, of those, uh, one of those mattresses that you need a motor to, uh, to inflate. So, there you have it. Four out of five stars. Comes pretty recommended. Um, but hopefully this uh, tells you if this suits your needs or not. Again, my name is Cameron. Thanks a lot for watching.